Good evening and welcome to this week's Out and About. Since restrictions have eased here in the UK, the local community have been looking forward to attending a number of social gatherings and in today's show we bring you highlights of one such event. The In Vogue Retail and Lifestyle Festival recently took place at the Damecha Lohana Centre and we were lucky enough to check it out. आज हमारा सबसे पहला शॉपिंग रिटेल एंड लाइफस्टाइल शॉपिंग फेस्टिवल है इट्स अ रिटेल एग्जीबिशन जहां पे अब हमारे पास ऑलमोस्ट 65 कंपनीज हैं जो बिजनेसेस हैं उन्होंने अपना स्टैंड लगाया है उन्होंने अपनी एग्जीबिशन बूथ लगाई है और हम लोग इतने खुश हैं कि टर्नआउट इतना अच्छा गया है हम लोग पिछले 6 महीने से प्लान कर रहे थे कि कोविड था कोविड नहीं था पेंडेमिक के बीच में बट भगवान की दुआ से सब कुछ इतना अच्छा हुआ है एवरीवन एवरीवन हैज यू नो कंट्रीब्यूटेड सब ने बहुत हार्ड वर्क किया है बिकॉज़ एज यू कैन सी देयर इज अ लॉट ऑफ टीम एफर्ट देयर इज अ स्टेज देयर इज अ प्रोडक्शन देयर इज डांसिंग देयर इज खाना पीना देयर इज फैशन ज्वेलरी एवरीथिंग इज गोइंग ऑन सो दिस इज व्हाट दिस होल इवेंट इज अबाउट So today we are very pleased that we are having this function here at Damecha Loana Center, uh, especially after the COVID uh, uh, closure and so on. This is our one of our biggest event uh, after COVID, and there is so many people here. We are excited that many many people are here, and we are happy that ZTV is here supporting our function here at Loana Community North London. As you know, Loana Com Community North London is one of the biggest community outside UK, and we have many many functions here. And uh, to see so many people, uh, it is exciting, and it is important that the community opens up. Uh, it gives us an opportunity to do many many programs, and very very soon we also going to have a Navratri event here for the first time live, and it's a 10 day event, and uh, we are looking forward to inviting all our guests here. at Damecha Loana Center in South Arrow. Hi everyone, I'm Nina from Nina's Choreography and today I'm going to be doing a Bollywood dance workshop. So I want to, I'm going to bring everyone on the floor and you know everyone has to follow what I teach and it's going to be exciting, buzzing and everything. It's just amazing and thrilling and exciting to see everybody because after lockdown this is probably the first biggest event. So it's exciting for us as performers which we haven't had it for last a year and a half. So I'm really 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 excited about everything today. So is everyone ready? Yes. Woo! One more time. Is everyone ready? Yes. All right. So we're going to start with our first move. Now first move is I want everyone to point. Come on everyone. Point. Everyone point. And we go Now from there we 
going to go. One more time. Ready? Because I love what you just did. Ready? One. Two. And then we're going to do is fly. And clap. We are so delighted that everybody can come here. We've seen many different people from different source of uh, variety of people who come here from all the communities and they are so happy. I've seen different type of stalls. Everybody is spending money. They've saved it over the a few months. They haven't had a chance. You look at the outfits, look, you look at the jewelry, people are buying Chevros and Nastas and all the people are so happy that we are back. So from the community point of view, you know, this is bringing so many people together after COVID. You know, this event, you know, it wouldn't have been possible a few months ago. And what it has actually done for the community, um, the community of businesses and community of charities like ourselves, it's actually getting us back out there again, but also meeting with people and explaining to them what we're doing and why we're doing it. Now, Food for All is a charity that was set up by me and my husband. We set it up six years ago and it's just gone from strength to strength. Over the COVID so from COVID today, we've served 380,000 meals. In June, I was um, I had a very good, big surprise from uh, the Queen's office. I was given a BEM, um, and my BEM I've actually brought it today so people can actually see that. And it, for me, it's about it's not about that I have this BEM, but it's going to make all the community proud as well, and they can see what is achievable. It's been successful. I mean, look around. It's it's brilliant. You know, all lovely dances, music, and lots of food, uh, and you know, people are really kind of into it and and really want to make the best of it. First of all, people have been in lockdown, so not, this is an event people can come out and enjoy and meet their friends. And um, the, the best thing I like about this event is got so many stalls, different um, you know wedding outfits, uh, casual outfits, evening wear, and uh, obviously in any event you can't go without Indian food. So Indian savory, Indian uh, mitai and masala tea. Very nice, very nice. It's just amazing to be here for the first time in this wonderful EEL exhibition. 
after so long in the lockdown, it's been an amazing time to come out. We're going to perform, make people dance. So that's what our purpose is today. I think to bring the community together, we need to have these kind of events, bring us all together, share the love that we have, especially after being away from each other. We have to support each other. And that's the best thing about community. Hey, you got what I want, Sony. Hey, I think about it every day. Baby looking like Hana Kazana on a play, ayy Like my Thai, like my Thai Like Kulfi, Ras Malai, ayy Pista Barfi, Sardiyan Vich Garmi Lag Di Jad Vi Tu Mere Raha Vich O Chal Di Yeah, Bab Vich Mere Kolo Lang Di Throw it back and bubble bubble up in front of me Everybody tryna figure out your recipe I'm just tryna get a piece, baby I know that you wanna get crazy, crazy Shorty take it slow, then chitti chitti Learn it, Japanese Time to take a very short break, but there's more still to come from this event when we come back. So make sure you join us again in part two. Welcome back to Out and About. For those of you who've just joined us, in today's show we bring you all the highlights from this year's In Vogue Retail and Lifestyle Festival. <laughs> Your essence of this event is the true community spirit because you have to Hindustani, Pakistani, Bangladeshi, Sri Lankans, Muslim, Hindu, Sikh, Isai, Europeans, English, everybody you will see, all different communities coming together and doing this event. And that is the beauty of what we are doing. It's not just that it's for one dharam, 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 for one dharam. It's all for all. We're all doing it together, we're all doing it together. And I think in the last year or two years, I haven't seen it yet, I haven't attended it yet. I think this is like the breakthrough. This is like the event which people have been looking forward to. Because the last 18 months have been very, very quiet. People have been, you know, sad. People have been depressed because they were sitting at home. And now everyone has a chance. मौका मिला कि आइए आके फुल धूम मचाते हैं खाना पीना चशन सब कुछ हो रहा है और नाच गाना भी हो रहा है शॉपिंग की शॉपिंग भी हो रही है तो ऑल इन वन पैकेज है आज हमारे पास
I think it brings everyone together. It brings a lot of different communities together and it brings a lot of different um, cultures together as well. And also because companies, they're not all, people think that companies are against each other all the time. They're not. A lot of the companies here today, they all know each other. They're part of the same association and they're really enjoying getting to see other people and what other people do. So, you know, you've got so many clothes companies, but it's not a massive competition like, oh my God, like there's someone else that's the same as me. No, you can see the dance performances on stage. They're doing it together, even though they're from two different dance communities. They're from two different, and people do different styles of stuff, styles of clothing, styles of dance, styles of food. So it's really good. And also we've been in a lockdown for the last two years. We need something to build that spirit again and tell people it's okay to come outside. It's okay to come to events. It's okay to mingle, you know, why not? extremely important. It's a great opportunity to come together for all businesses, be it a small business or a big setup. I think you get a lot of opportunity to meet similar businesses or maybe a different industry to collaborate and see what's going on in the world. I think this whole event should be something that should happen every other month perhaps because it's not just a good opportunity for the people who are owning a business but also for people to actually witness and meet and you know get exposure to things that we probably are not aware and uh, it's all Asian community after all isn't it we should connect we should collaborate we should support each other and uh, I'm loving this I think this should be more often and I'm really looking forward to upcoming events. Hello everybody, I'm Sakshi Desai and um, it's great to be here at the Dharmecha Lohana Center in the In Vogue Lifestyle and uh, uh, Lifestyle Fest. And it's a beautiful, um, a beautiful, what do you call, event where there are so many local businesses who are uh, exhibiting today. I'm uh, standing here at one as well and uh, I think it's such exhibitions should be like they should we should really encourage uh, such exhibitions to go ahead because we have to support our local businesses and uh, it's a great effort by uh, Joy Deep here who has uh, taken the effort to bring all the local businesses together and yeah we are here to support them. <laughs> I mean, it's been uh, a very, very long journey. Um, it's been a whole roller coaster, so I could be here for a whole day talking about it. <laughs> um, but to cut it short, I used to be a dancer when I was uh, a kid, and I used to dance in music videos, and then I met a producer who signed me, and um, I started performing with, uh, with my music since I was 16 years old. 
Um, and so now I took a bit of a break and then I've come back and now it's nice to have my, um, I'm an independent artist now. So I've got my own label, my own team and yeah, we've been performing a lot since, since lockdown, which is great. I'm drowning, drowning, deep into your ocean, frozen, can't have all these emotions growing, but I know it's you that I've chosen. I think it's, it's important because everyone wants to get out now, you know, we've all been stuck inside for a year and a half um, and it's just nice to get out and do what I, what I love doing um, and it's, it's an excuse for everyone to get out and even today everyone's, it's nice to see people out and doing normal things. <laughs> I just want to say thank you so much to everyone who has supported me from day one and to everyone who's just finding out about me. I really appreciate your support and I feel a lot of pleasure supporting Asians. Our best wishes to everybody involved with organising that wonderful event. That's all we've got time for in this week's show, but we'll be back on your screens again next weekend. So until then, have a wonderful week. Take care. Bye-bye.